Hey guys, I'm Technoga here in another, another video. So first in my channel, so please subscribe my channel and only awesome videos like this one. So guys, today we learn how you control a, your stock cooler, CPU stock cooler fan in an exhaust fan into BIOS. So without wasting any more time, so let's start this video. So first in my channel, so please subscribe my channel and only awesome videos like this one. So let's start this guys now set up my uh, camera now we have go first uh, windows and now uh, check the power i need to go reset i mean press the delete key button so just click away and the black skin appear Now my screen is black now. Now we go to the BIOS. So now let's uh, learn how this works. So first I zoom my camera. So guys, this is a help. Uh, you guys look. You guys look a uh, uh, CPU clock ratio, uh, ring ratio, AVS oxygen and advanced CPU settings now, system memory, multiple memory wrap clock, memory ward ratio, advanced memory settings, and it's a uh, 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 core voltage mode, CPU force, and dynamic force DVI-D, and black adaptive voltage, CPU graphics voltage, and PXG. And drum voltage, HDB, and advanced voltage settings. Auto, 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 auto. Now, tweaker, we have learned tweaker. Now, we go to smart fan 5. You learn this. This is a smart fan 5. You zoom it, you know. You will be this is a smart fan 5. Now, we have to tap this. Now, you learn. Full thing. You will. This is now CPU fan speed controller, fan control is temperature unit, temperature interval, CPU fan control mode and CPU fan stop. Now this is the running and this is the monitoring the temperature of the CPU. And this is the you look, this is the fan speed now. You guys look, this is the now. Uh, okay, this is the this is fan speed is now 16072 RPM and this is the temperature of CPU fan and flow rate this is the flow rate this is temperature and now we go to how you control a stock cooler and intake cooler fan and so you install a only you use a stock cooler and you will not use any uh, Exhaust fan in CPU, so uh, not a matter. But when you, uh, I am not using uh, exhaust fan in my uh, CPU, so not showing the exhaust fan. And when you install exhaust fan, so you showing uh, one exhaust fan one, exhaust fan two, exhaust fan three. Is different uh, 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 how many exhaust fan you install your CPU. So but I, I am not using any. Uh, uh, exhaust fan in my uh, CPU, uh, CPU. I use only a uh, stock cooler in my CPU, so I only control a fan CPU fan speed. But no matter, uh, uh, you install a exhaust fan and how you control the same process. Okay, no matter. So now we let's start it. This is the normal CPU one auto. So it's full speed. I have a manual. Up, you listen a sound the fan speed is normal and now okay sorry it's uh, silent the fan is silent now as a full speed you listen the sound you listen the fans full speed sound 
Can you listen now? And now I normal. Now again. They listen the full speed. And this is the manual. And so silent. So normal speed now. Very simple and very simple. Okay. Now you look at flow rate. See if you flow rate. See if you temperature in my LG screen. The uh, 9.7588 element temperature is 34.0 degrees Celsius. And CPU fan is a system. And CPU pitch and VRM loss and CPU 340C system. And CPU speed controller, fan control, use temperature input. And this is the auto voltage PWM. Okay, this is temperature input, CPU fan. CPU fan control mode, CPU fan stop and now ok, my fan is going to normal speed uh, normal speed and manual speed is ideal for your CPU but you not run the full speed, you try to run a normal speed and when you uh, uh, tap the full speed the fan is so noisy so normal speed is ideal for uh, use uh, CPU now and this is smart fan CPU fan this system fan is no the fan speed zero okay this is CPU fan now now we have go uh, back side of area and this is the easy mode and this now you look at CPU fan uh, running and seventeen zero four PRM and this fan NA. This is the latest version of Windows 10, but you look Windows Vista, Windows Vista BIOS, a different type of my different type of uh, BIOS, but it's the Windows 10 BIOS. Okay, the so my DDRM status to speak tech four GB two six six hertz information BIOS for E4 CPU Intel Pentium this is a Pentium uh, really I use 